When The Dark Knight Rises first released into cinemas, there was a lot of discussion about whether or not Bruce Wayne survived the atomic bomb detonation. Despite the fact that Christopher Nolan provided all the necessary information for audiences to deduce that Wayne survived, there were still those who questioned whether or not Alfred was imagining Bruce at the cafe. As a filmmaker, I interpret this discussion as a symptom of a filmmaker that has taught his audience that they cannot trust his storytelling. This is largely because Nolan has many twists at the end of his non-Batman films and doesn't offer enough information to guide his audiences to see the ending that's obviously there. Even with a modest twist, like Bruce Wayne having survived a nuclear explosion, audiences begin to suspect that maybe the real twist is that he actually died. I mean, hey, there was a funeral scene after all, and when a filmmaker gives you information, it must be considered important until it's verified to be unimportant. Despite his Batman trilogy being a masterwork of cinema, Christopher Nolan cannot be trusted as a filmmaker.